All right, 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 all right. Today is December 1st, I guess, of, uh, you know, 2015. This video should come all across pretty self-explanatory, right? I'm resetting the NBA to 2015 to see what the hell would happen if I put this in the hands of 2K. You get it, right? I've done it with a lot, a lot of decades, like the 90s, the 2003. Wait, that's not a decade, but this one should probably be shorter because I only plan on going until 2021, I guess. Uh, sure, or whatever, the current day. I don't know when the hell I'll consider that. As you can tell, uh, things are quite different. You see, uh, Joel Embiid, this was uh, the second year after he was drafted, and he kind of just didn't play for his first two years because he keep get, kept getting injured. So, um, you know, there's him, the, this Greek guy that's finally starting to come into his own. He would end up winning a bunch of MVPs eventually. But as of now, uh, no. And then you got uh, Carl Landry. But actually, though, let me let me just read off these uh, things, you know. Before I forget, you could click the buttons underneath the video if you like my content and want to see more of the content. The comment something stupid. I don't know if the comments help the algorithm, honestly. I really have no clue. But as soon the liking does maybe just nothing really matters but you could still just click the things um hey uh look philadelphia nerland's noel prime nerland's noel the best player on this team well not really prime he's 21 this is uh his like third year or something julio okafor in his rookie season he averaged like 18 a game this year and then uh so on and so forth robert covington who was a big part of the process and oh yeah guess what they have christian wood and jeremy grant two guys who are actually probably like the top two most improved player candidates unless i'm forgetting somebody i'm probably forgetting somebody right bucks Giannis, middleton young as hell but kind Kinda actually not that young from he's 25. Carlos Boozer, Ray Allen. What the hell? I think they just signed him for free agency. Actually, he never actually played for the Bucks, so uh, didn't even look at free agency. But I guess uh, they already took some of the players out of there. And uh, Greg Oden. What the hell? The Bulls. Jimmy Butler, Pau Gasol, Derrick Rose, Joakim Noah. A year before he got the big body deal from the Knicks. Nikola Mirotic, Cristiano Felicio. How has he been there for so long? Probably called getting signed to a contract. Um, LeBron James, Kyrie Irving, Kevin Love. This is kind of the year where they went on to you know. Uh, 3 1 lead kind of came back from that. You remember that, right? Nah, not really. Why is Mo Williams an eight? Well, I mean, like, was Mo Williams? I don't even remember Mo Williams on this team. Am I trash? At least it's not as an 80 overall, but a high Richard Jefferson. Oh, and one more guy, Joe Harris, 67 overall. Wait, does Joe Harris have a ring? Boston Celtics. Was this the year before Isaiah started going crazy? Because, no, I feel like this was the year. Maybe it was the, yeah, no, actually, it was the year after this. Never mind, but he's an 81 overall. And there you go. Rest of the team is basically just the team, you know. Danny Granger, I guess, signed here. And Yona. Yurebko. Remember he had like a really cool uh, put back with one team and then he got like 50,000 followers and like a night. Oh no, it was on the Warriors. Yeah. Lob City Clippers are st still fully intact as uh, I don't have any water at hand. So I'm just, oh, hey, look, it's Paul Pierce. Memphis Grizzlies still at like the bitter end, bitter end, what? I don't know, uh, of the grit and grind era. Jeff Green, Ninja Michael Green, Atlanta Hawks, Jeff Teague. Oh, I think this is the year they were like first in the East or something, right? Maybe it was, no, it was the year before this actually. But uh, yeah, all these uh, top four guys were all-stars and so was DeMar. Carroll, but I think he left for the Raptors, right? Hi, hi, Chasen, Chasan, right? I used to call him Chasan when he's on the Knicks, but I think his name is actually Chasen. I really don't care. Yo, RIP to who I'm about to mention, but yo, um, am I bugging or does Chasen, Chasan, whatever the hell, Randall look exactly like Chadwick Bozeman? Am I bugging or am I, am I bugging? I'm definitely not bugging here. Miami Heat, LeBron left, obviously, so now you got D Wade Bosch. This is actually the second year after LeBron left? Yeah, the second year. Oh, yeah, and they traded for Drogic. They got Whiteside in his prime. Oh, yeah, and they took a mark. Luau. I mean, Luau. Luau was a 73 overall in the heat and then somehow the Lakers gave him like four no not even like a hundred million or something Kemba Walker Al Jefferson Michael Kidd Gilchrist in the great Hornets team oh and big baby Davis wow look at you Utah Gordon Hayward this is like the year of or maybe yeah I think it was the year that he made the all-star team or something like that Derek Favors go bear before the DPOIs Joe Ingles has still been here this entire time and uh Kem Birch he, I would assume you're just a free agent signee right yeah Sacramento oh man I forgot about prime DeMar Marcus, you got Prime Boogie, Prime Rudy Gay, Prime Darren Collison, Prime Rajon Rondo, Norvell Pell, definitely another addition. Yeah, he's not even in the league for that long. New York, uh, definitely didn't forget about Prime Mello, but in a way, I feel like I kind of did actually. Uh, um, this is rookie year Kristaps, 75 overall with Mello. And Robin Lopez, he was pretty cool actually. He's a, he a nice looking post hook and he played all 82 games. I remember that. Edo, I don't think was on this team. I don't, yeah. Thanasis, you gave us like 30 the other day somehow. And Billy Hernan Gomez and Sasha. Uh, Kobe, 85 overall. This is his, oh yeah, right. This is Kobe's farewell tour, which I would assume he doesn't. I feel like players usually retire when they're like 40 in 2K. So he might not retire for a minute still. D'Angelo, Julius Randall Clarkson. I was seeing how people were talking about, oh yeah, all these guys are now like all stars, six men of the year type of caliber. But at least the Lakers got a ring. Uh, Nikola Vucevic, Oladipo, Tobias Harris. This is probably like the best team he ever had. Kind of, not really. I don't know. The league I traded to Chicago, which I think they're actually not even doing that great now. Dirk Nowitzki. This was uh, your last year too? Second, second to last, probably. I don't remember actually. Actually, no, you played in. 
until like last year, two years ago. I don't even know what's going on anymore, honestly. What is life? Brooklyn Nets, Brooke Lopez, franchise's all-time leading scorer. And then you got Jarrett Jack. I saw Jarrett Jack hit a game winner once. I, I was at the Barclays Center for one of like my three appearances there. That appearance is like it was a public appearance. I was like eight, not eight. I was like 13. Yeah, yeah. That's better, man. Kenneth Fareed, the best player in the Nuggets. Wow, this is a throwback. So this is already after they got rid of, rid of Ty Lawson too. And oh my God, rookie Jokic. Did Jokic stay overseas for one year? Or was he just bad? I don't remember. Or just, you know what I mean? A rookie. Juan Toscano Anderson definitely was in the league, but that's cool. Paul George, prime 90 overall PG. He's probably not even far off from that nowadays, but who really cares? He was super elite though. I remember like 2014 or something, everyone was talking about he might be in the MVP race. And then again, he also did make the MVP race like two years ago. We, we, nobody talked about it. They talked about Pandemic P. Pelicans, AD, my God, you're so good at basketball. Nate Robinson, wow. Ish Smith, Walt Frazier's favorite person, and uh, Ryan Anderson. I would have assumed was actually a high overall in 70, but okay. Detroit, Andre Drummond, Dinwiddie, Reggie Jackson, Jody Meeks. Such a boring team. Reggie Bullock, though, I like you on the Knicks nowadays, though. You're a very good three-point shooter. And uh, Kyle Lowry, 87. DeMar, 84. Um, here's the rap. There's Norman Powell still up here. I saw he wrote like a whole article about getting traded from there. I mean, he's pretty cool. He's been around for a minute. Luis Scola, wow. And Anthony Bennett, he actually was on this team, too. Look at you. Rockets, Harden is Harden. Jason Terry was the second best player on the team. Wow. Pat Bev, there goes Ty Lawson. Knew he'd be here. And wow, Howard was a 78. I don't know if I'd ever give Clint the advantage over Dwight in the Rockets era. Because Dwight, look at the Dwight numbers. 14 and 12, but then Clint was averaging 7 and 6. He has not higher overall. I guess we'll rock with it. Whatever. Hi, Michael Beasley. Oh, man, it's Michael Beasley. Why Leonard, Tim Duncan, oh my god, 296 and 95 overall at 39 years old? How is that even? Okay. Is Bertons? I forgot Bertons on this team. Wow. How did I forget that? That was during like the weird era of the Spurs or like where Kawhi was sitting out for years. Um, And uh, Kyle Anderson, slow-mo himself. Then you got D book tj warren tony warren jr ronnie price i have no clue who this is landry fields love i love landry oklahoma city kd westbrook abaca steven adams steve novak what how are you still a 78 in this day, day and age timberwolves wait what are you on crack who the dude who made this are you on what are you on this man kg was a mean role player by the time he was on this timberwolves team there's no way in hell you know how i know that because this man got traded from the nets to the th to the timberwolves for uh for thaddeus young I think it was straight up and like a and you know what i mean a, a tour to come back to his old team and you gave this man a 93 overall i'm so tempted to lower this my own self everything else in this roster is mad accurate maybe timmy was kind of high too timmy was definitely kind of high paul wait I, I, not like that towns is towns levine wigan all right sure have your prime what prime, what damian lillard 95 overall don't know if you were that good already but i mean you're a hey, you're damian lillard you probably get there within a year anyway actually yeah you already had multiple all-star appearances gerald henderson that's a throwback and uh tim frazier why are you looking at me like that, Tim? Steph Curry with the Steph Curry is Steph Curry. Sean Livingston, the mid-range guy. I saw something like, oh, Steph Curry made more threes in one game than Sean Livingston made in his entire career. Andrew Bogut. Wow, you already watched. Yeah, remember when Andrew Bogut got signed to the Cavs and he got injured in 60 seconds and it was over for his career? Actually, I think he might have came back to the Warriors again after that somehow. Bradley Beal, John Wall, Kelly Oubre, Marcin Gortat. This is the final team. Chris Humphreys, Dewan Blair, the man with no ACLs. In, one of, in the 03 video, I think I asked who was the man who had no ACL. I even think I remembered it like 10 minutes later, but I still just wanted the comments to see. And Nene, somehow the worst player on this team. Okay. Yep, that's all your teams. That is every single team. The Sixers are the last in the power rankings. Uh, Spurs are number one in two of these. Let's see. 2K Sports has Celtics number one. Oh, the Celtics number one. I don't really know. Let's just simulate, dog. Let's rock with it. I, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna be honest. I'm lowering KG. Dog, this man, Kevin Garnett, averaged three points in this season. And you gave the season before seven, then seven. Like, dog, he was not nice. Give this man a clean 77 overall thanks 78 that works okay so you could have an 80 you could have an 80 there you go just for the fact of being kevin garnett and good at defense but no way up here the hell goes nothing i'm gonna root for sixers trust the process shout out to my friend john he'll probably I, will he be watching this video i don't know for some reason he's like insane and he decided to become a sixers fan when they're really bad and truly trust the process he's from he's like he's from new york like me i mean i know the knicks are always bad too but and now here they are with mvps like joel Embiid, even though he's injured right now or actually he might have just came back he got dunked on by town the other night he definitely came back team lebron and team james i wonder who they are oh yeah james and lebron okay look at these all-star teams you got paul Millsap out here drummond out here dirk out here vucevic is a starter and no kobe wow actually well then again he is like an 85 but still i expected him to just get buckets on that team then again maybe the team's okay i don't know that'd be good uh i guess quinn cook came over here to the 76ers and he's the starting point guard obviously i don't think he was in the league uh, he was close enough he's starting and being kind of trash and b shoots 37 wow that's bad
bad. Barry Parker leads the Bucks in scoring. Oh boy, Derrick Rose is Derrick Rosing. LeBron is LeBron. It's Kobe doing. Oh, Mel what? Why is Melo only averaging 16? What the hell? Aaron, if you don't pass the ball, KP's taking more shots than this man. What is going on? And Kobe's averaging 23. This man, Melo, had a 65 shot tendency. He had a 65. I don't even care, honestly. I, 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 I don't make this man shoot. Oh, okay. So Damian Lillard, just a light 40 a game at his cat. Manu is Manu. Kawhi is Kawhi. Good for you. I think he might have won it this year, actually, the DPOI. Maybe it was the year prior. Who cares? Uh, Mason Plumley, most improved. That's cool. For Good for you. Actually, a realistic kind of one, because I think he was in like a weird role with Denver or... I don't actually... Oh, wait, no. It was vice versa. He was on Portland first. I think I traded Denver. Okay, I'm talking. JB Bickerstaff, coach of the year. Yeah, I don't expect him to change the coaches or nothing. Uh, shout out to Tyron Lula. Carl, AD, LeBron, Harden, and then and, 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 Kawhi, Tim Duncan, and Boogie. Then you got Jimmy, John Wall, KD, Dirk, and Vucevic. D Wade can play defense. Meta World Peace can play defense at a 74 overall. Look at you making all defensive team at a 74 overall. Hold on. Ah, give this man his right, his right of uh, his respect. Okay, you know what, Ross? guy though you did set all the rookies to one year pro or whatever zero year pro wait how is towns a 90 as a rookie i did not think about that oh my god something's wrong with me wait actually matter of fact you made Embiid have zero years pro too actually no he actually would have because he didn't play how is devin booker in 89 as a i don't know we're just gonna rock with it you'll and you would have ended up there in two years anyways why am i why did i already just simulate game uh, i don't even really even care what teams suck to be honest with you let's see like, if you were bad then okay great you were bad the grit and grind error oh, actually can we see trades ron butler for a second round pick oh this is so exciting exciting kyle core for nicholas batum nicholas batum been on the hornets for that long oh yeah it was the same year that lamarcus left. speaking of that so they got dog no tim duncan should not be this good this is what i'm talking about oh screw it simulate the playoffs bring me ayo uh actually no 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 wait league leaders damian lillard Harden, cj mccollum wow you had two guys all the way up here at lebron and westbrook does westbrook look so sad or i guess uh katie's still on the team though so that's good for them rebounds drummond davis vucevic jordan and valanchunas assist lebron Lillard, James, Wall, and Parker. I said James instead of Harden, which make me sound like I'm saying LeBron James, but I could say either one. I don't know. The goal percentage was JaVale. Three-point percentage was Steve Novak. Nuggets were trash. Grizzlies were trash. Suns were trash. So that doesn't really matter that D-Book was good anyways. Clippers, Kings, Mavericks, Jazz. Rockets were the best. Spurs were second. Uh, the Warriors, you guys were supposed to, uh, or actually, yeah, yeah, you were supposed to go 72 and, or 73 and 9 in this season. So uh, I wonder what happened to that. And why is Draymond only in 81? This is his best season. Uh, Timberwolves are still pretty good even with towns not being that great andre miller sure whatever oh wow lake oh i like i like how they got the young version of kobe still in here though lakers made the playoffs so that's pretty cool and in kobe's well in real life his final year but you know what i mean his farewell tour but i don't know if he'll actually retire and uh the pelicans made it too as the 18 i think they did that in real life too how did jr only average three or seven look at the wizards second seed actually yeah this year they were pretty probably pretty solid because they were always pretty solid wow the pistons made it led by spencer dinwiddie i'm just gonna let it rock at this point um okay uh Rand Raptors are the Raptors. We'll see how they can do in the playoffs. We know it usually resulted in though heat. Actually, that's similar to what they did in real life as well with the Hassan Whiteside era. All George's pace was able to rough it out at the sixth seed or whatever. Hawks were hawking. Milford Payton led the uh, Magic to the eighth seed and that's it. Everybody else was trash. How did Derrick Rose miss the playoffs? They were all tied for the eighth seed too. Hornets too. I thought this was LaMelo for a second. That was really stupid. The entire Atlantic division except for one of the teams, the Raptors, was the bottom four in this conference. I don't even know the divisions of the West, to be honest with you. Okay, let's get to the um let's get to the conference finals or something real quick atlanta goodbye deuces orlando deuces los angeles deuces pelicans deuces in fact did the clippers not make the playoffs i said los angeles yeah the clippers sold miami deuces portland deuces they are the two goat scorers and okc and oh uh, well detroit we expected that one the upsets detroit got upset by indiana i guess that's not really an upset oh look at monte ellis the guy cleveland 4-0 oh wow yeah and golden state okay good i'm actually happy you won that would have been really weird if you lost but i guess the the trailblazers were kind of goaded though minnesota somehow beat the yeah okay at least kg's tendencies are correct i guess because he only averaged 11 i mean that's solid enough i'll take it out of an 80 80 overall guy they beat the thunder though in the first round so towns and levine in them levine was just bugging out too Levine was actually already pretty good by this point so i'll let that you know i mean that's cool Towns averaged 36 a game in the playoffs what the hell and dropped 53 on on kendrick perkins head right is it perkins no it's adams what am i talking about the spurs got the lakers out of here 4-0 sweep okay second round
round. Let's see. Uh, yeah, deuces to the Pacers. Get them the hell up out of here. 4-1 win. Golden State gets eliminated by Houston. Harden. The Spurs just got to come back. The, the, the Timberwolves came back and beat the Spurs down 2-3 to three and won 4-3. to three. And the Raptors got eliminated by the Cavs in seven games. Yep, sorry, DeRozan and them. You know, I mean, they said, what did they say about uh, DeRozan says something about LeBron once when he's like, oh, I don't know how the hell to guard him. So you got the one versus six seed and the one versus two seed. This is actually a pretty interesting matchup. Why is John Wall not better? I don't know. It doesn't really matter, though, I guess, if they're still here anyways. And why is Nene starting? I said he was the worst player on the roster. Is that their best center? I don't know. James Harden versus Zach Levine and Towns versus Montrez, who was already in 83, I guess. Definitely wasn't, but we'll, we'll rock. Oh, they got Beasley. Wait, I forgot about Michael Beasley. Hold on. How did I forget about Michael Beasley? Oh, man, game 14 a game. How was Montrez this good already? This is Montrez's rookie year, too. I lost, and they do have actually a pretty solid all-around team, though, but like, you know, I mean, Montrez wasn't this good, and Michael Beasley is God, so he probably should be averaging at least 25. Simulate the round, dog. Okay, goodbye, Minnesota. Bye. And Cleveland won, too. Beal is a bucket getter, so you know he got his buckets, and then, well, uh, LeBron. John Wall was still John Wall, and regardless, and uh, yep, LeBron, Kevin Love, Kyrie. Wow, that's a very LeBron, Kevin Love, and Kyrie type of game. Although, I feel like Kevin Love really wasn't putting up, it was just Kyrie and LeBron putting up 40 for the most part. So, forget the 3-1 lead, because, well, um, the Rockets this time around beat the Warriors. Got him the hell up out of here. I believe this was the year. I mean, then again, the Rockets and Warriors played like every single year in the playoffs. But I believe this was the year where um the the Harden had like the league record for turnovers ever or something. Okay, yeah, it was the year after or the year before this. So whatever. Either way, he had 12 turnovers. Oh, did he do it again? Yeah, he did it again in 2013. Hi, Luca. Welcome to the club. And uh, okay, let's see. Game numero uno is Harden about to get his this man. Uh, 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 wait, what? That's so thrown off by Ty Lawson dropping 29. You got to give me uh you know what I mean a pass there. What the hell? This man bodied Kyrie in game one. Hold on. Forget what I was about to say. Let's just continue. I was going to say it's hard about to get himself a ring. And then I seen Ty Lawson bugging out. Okay. Well, uh, in game two, it's a one point lead for the Cavs with 115 left. They have the ball. LeBron, you might want to guard that guy. A uh, uh, Kyrie. Oh boy. Prime number two Kyrie. I mean, he's still in his prime. You seen those shots he was hitting yesterday against the Knicks? I saw him because I was watching the game. I'm a Knicks fan. I love Kyrie though. But uh, hey, uh, LeBron, LeBron. It's Harden. Oh, you know, this this is definitely a retro Harden because Harden don't got that haircut no more. He had the, the, the faux hawk or the mohawk or whatever you want to call it. I don't even know. Why did he do that? Um, okay, Harden pull up for three. That's off. Why did he do that as well? Mo Williams in the game, number 52. I honestly kind of enjoy how stupid this roster is. <laughs> Why is Mo Williams an 80? Was he really that good? Someone got to inform me. I know he dropped 50 one of these years. Uh, Kevin Love. Mo Williams, even when he dropped 50, he was probably like a 73 in 2K. Oh, man. Wow. Yeah, Clint Capella, you can't really guard Bron Bron. You know what? Uh, okay, uh, LeBron, though, he missed it. And LeBron, the second one, makes that one. I feel discombobulated. Is that how you say discombobulated or discombobulated? Who cares? That shows how, how discombobulated I feel right now. I love when they play 2K14 theme music. Oh, yeah. Beasley. What is that shot? Okay, he hit it anyway. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, they fouled Bron Bron. What's his free throw in this day and age? I know he already missed one, but I didn't see the... Oh, what? Oh, 59%. He still made it. He's LeBron. Bron Doggy D. Second free throw at the line. And it goes. No more timeouts for Houston. Harden, what you got in you, big dog? Shout out Travis Scott. Shout out Beyonce. Ah, step back. Hold on. Step back again. Harden, no, no. Stop doing that step back. That step back is so awful. I'm simulating out. Goodbye. 126 to 124. Call that a game. That one is over with. Jason Terry, 29 points. I love this. 123, 123, 122, 33 seconds left. Houston is down by one. Hey, love, big dog passing to Mr. James. He looks like he needs accessories. Does he ever wear leg sleeves? Maybe he doesn't. I don't know. LeBron going to the basket and he loses the ball stolen by Capella. Oh man, the DPOI. Where is James? Where is Harden? I don't know. Why is Ty Lawson existing right now? Kyrie just blocked Ty Lawson. That's it. It. Uh, the game isn't over, but where is James Harden? Why didn't Michael Beasley take that shot if you don't have James Harden in? Is James still not in? He's still not in. He must have fouled out, and Kyrie hit both free throws. Oh, the Jet Terry's got you back. Uh, just give it to Jason, and he'll hit the shot, and you'll win. I think they show that LeBron had 45 points. Yeah, that's a light work. Oh, boy. Jason the Jet Terry. Here we go. What the hell? Don't shoot that. Oh, over to Beasley. Michael Beasley court contested three. I already knew that wasn't going in. You know this. Goodbye. Adios. 124, 127. LeBron, 45. Lost in 30, 39. What is wrong with you, Ty? I love the Jay-Z Jay uh, impersonation guy on Twitter. I thought of Ty because I thought of Jay-Z because, you know, you know when he says, sitting up to Ty, Ty, sitting court, sitting, what, what am I saying? Sitting court, side, Nixon, Nets. Yeah, you remember that, right? Uh, Empire State of Mind. Oh, <laughs> shit. Over. Why is every game so close? If you don't just, oh, there's 44 seconds left and the Rockets are up by one. Jason the Jet, Terry, oh, oh, he choked, he choked. James Harden not in again? Yeah, might as well. Oh, oh, Mo Williams for three. Mo, Mo, big doggy dog. Please.
believe in leading the series 2-1. They might take a 3-1, though, and uh, hopefully the Rockets don't do the opposite of what Cleveland did, or the, what Cleveland did exactly. That's supposed to be Matthew Delavid. Oh, wait, no, Matthew Delavidova is still in the league. Where is he? Did leave the team after 2015? I don't remember. Did he get, like, a big deal somewhere else? I actually don't remember. No, he definitely still with this team. I don't know where he's at, though. I mean, he's not playing no minutes, I don't think. Jason Terry, where is Harden again? This man fouled out again. Ooh, behind the back, the Jets spin move, and he got blocked by Love. Kevin Love coming up clutch with defense again. History repeats itself, and uh, LeBron James, 22 seconds left, 18 seconds left, 17 seconds left, 16 seconds left, 15 seconds left, 14 seconds left. They're kind of winding out the clock a little bit, because it's a smart thing to do when you have the basketball possession in your hands, and you're winning the game, and LeBron missed it. Kevin Love rebound. Oh, yeah, it's over. Mo Williams going to take some free throws in this rap. He might not even take free throws. They might not even have enough time. And I see where James is again. James Harden, James Harden. Fouled out. Fouled out again. Michael Beasley and Jason Terry leading the team. He only played 17 minutes and fouled out, and we're still this close in the game. That just shows you how good this supporting cast is. He says, sitting courtside, Knicks and Nets give me high fives. Hold on. JR and the game's over. Oh, how did they get that foul off? I don't care. Tristan hit some free throws. Who cares? Game over. Wow, he actually hit both free throws. I'm surprised. Kyrie Irving, LeBron James, and Mo Williams. That big three. 3-1 three, lead for Cleves. Anyone ever called them Cleve? Hopefully not. And Houston won a game. Big night for Ty Lawson posting a career high 12 assists. Probably not a career high. It's just he he's an auto-generated player. So let's try this again. Uh, Houston. No, they said no. Yeah, let's try this again. All right. The Beard 45. I hate when they call him the Beard. Has anyone ever called him the Beard? Obviously, yeah, it's his nickname. I was just call him, you know, Mr. Harden or something. Oh my God. Are they about to blow a 3-1 lead? Are they? They actually did it. They actually did it. So matter of fact, give me control. Now nah, I'm about to shoot a step back with Harden just to be weird. Um, After all of that, after what happened in real life, you know, with the, the Warriors and all that. Hold on. Step back. Step back. Oh, I didn't do the cool step back though. It's cool though. The Houston Rockets just overcame a 3-1 lead from the Cavaliers instead of the Cavaliers overcoming a 3-1 lead from the Warriors and won the championship. That is, um, that is. Hey, JB Bickerstaff was the coach of the Rockets. I thought he was the coach of the, okay. Cause you know, usually that, that I know, I know the, the algorithms in 2K. I know the head coach usually shakes the hand of the losing players, the winning coach. Um, uh, hi. Yep. Clint Capella, a hard end when his finals MVP. Dwight Howard gets the championship a few years earlier. He, I didn't even see him play a minute because they had two centers better than them, I guess. That's probably so much I missed when going over the rosters and critiquing them. Trevor Ariza and his cousins. Harden, 34. LeBron, 31 and 10. But guess what? Um, Richard Jefferson, not enough from you because Ty Lawson, Montrez, Terry, Capella, Dwight, Beasley. How did uh, well, Beverly and Ariza scored zero? He went from missing 28 straight threes to this. Oh, that was in a completely different year. But uh, Harden, 27 and 7 to win finals MVP on 44% shooting and 33% from downtown. Wow. Well, I mean, it was the one versus one seed, and uh, here the hell we go. Kevin Garnett retired. Thank God. I didn't want no more of you, because that was weird that you were still playing. And uh, um, Tim Duncan, goodbye, deuces. Uh, Andre Miller, deuces. Jason Terry, deuces. Paul Pierce, Ray Allen. That's you actually. Wait, did I say Ray Allen never played for the Bucks? Yeah, no, he definitely played for the Bucks. I didn't mean to say that. I just meant, like, at the end of his career, he never went back, you know, in, like, real life. Uh, I said that earlier for sure. I already know people are going to be commenting. Oh, click production. Hi, right, who wants to draft Ben Simmons this year? Let's see. Oh, actually, do we want to see the draft lottery? Uh, I don't really care. Actually, yeah, screw it. Whatever. Uh, skip to lottery results. Grizzlies, Kings, Knicks via the Clippers. They just swap picks. Whatever. I didn't reset the picks, but uh, hey, cool. Ben Simmons to the Grizzlies. Jalen Brown to the Kings. Buddy Heald to the Knicks. Levert to the Sixers. Ingram to the Celtics. DeJounte to the Nets. Knicks get Jamal Murray. Malik Beasley to the Nuggets. He just got injured yesterday. I saw, I have both the uh, D'Angelo Russell and Malik Beasley on my fantasy team. So one of them came back yesterday and one of them got injured for another four weeks. So just thanks for that. Oh, yes. A lot of players are definitely free agents. Wow. That's a lot of really good basketball players. Let's see what happens. Oh, okay. So LeBron went to the Raptors. James Harden to the Spurs. KD to the Cavaliers. Can I? Oh, my God. Can I show you something? Can I show you something I did for this video? CPU re-signing aggressiveness. 90. I have no control over any of this stuff. 2K is 2K. I don't control this. Westbrook still with the Thunder. That man is so loyal. Damian Lillard went to the Bulls. Wade to the Heat. Kobe to the... Oh, wow. Kobe stood too. So wait, now Kobe uh, Kobe has AD on his team now? Harden, instead of ever getting blocked by Manu, who just joined Manu's team. Mar to the Wizards. Powell to the Timberwolves. Conley to the Thunder. Dirk to the Kings. Manu to the Raptors. Oh, took, took his spot. Sorry, James. You're not going to be with him. Al Jefferson to the Celtics. Harrison Barnes to the Magic. Did anybody go anywhere rational? Well, uh, Kawhi and Harden are together on the Spurs. Oh my God. Why did it take that so long to register? Raptors have Lowry, LeBron, and Ginobili. Nurkic went up by six overalls. That's the most interesting to happen this offseason. Obviously, Magic, Oladipo is becoming Oladipo. Lakers have Kobe, who went down by one. D'Angelo went up by seven, and Anthony Davis. They still got him anyways, the AD guy, but no, uh, no LeBron, though. Porzingis is Porzingis. DeMarcus is DeMarcus. Bob City is still intact. Now you guys are just going to get burned by every other team, like the Kawhi and Harden duo. Oh my God. Oh my God. I just realized KD 
Katie and Kyrie. Okay, that makes it slightly more enjoyable that Kay Katie and Kyrie just teamed up anyway. So basically, Lemicki, you know, Lemicki, he ran from his team. I hate, I hate Lemicki. No, actually, you know what? We're just gonna rock with Lemicki. Yeah, no, he 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 left his team, and then Katie went to go and handle the the team that he left behind. So you know, what I mean, Katie's the real man here in this scenario. He didn't go bandwagon to another team. Although Russell Westbrook is still alone now. Oh, he has Mike Conley. That definitely won't help. And he has Michael Beasley. That will help. Season number two, 2016-17. Just like real life, this is gonna be a really weird season. But in fairness, real life already happened, and this is our our uh, universe. Team Stephen, Team Stephen Curry. Uh, hey, uh, Montrez Harold. Did Montre oh wait, right, Montrez and Clickapella both just made it because Harden left them. Can I see what stats they're averaging. Those are the only two players in the entire league that I'm uh, concerned about right now. Montrez is averaging 28. Clickapella is averaging 17 and 10. Or, no, 17 and 17. Oh my God, the exact same points. I thought his defensive rebounds per game was his rebounds per game, and then Ty Lawson is averaging 19 too. And Joe Johnson, what the hell? Hi, LeBron of the Le Le Raptors is the MVP. Ben Simmons, Memphis is rookie of the year. Yusuf Nurkic, six man of the year. Kawhi Leonard, the DP. Wait, who is he six man behind? Is Jokic starting? Or is, is Jokic already started? I don't know. Kawhi is still DPOI. Click Appella, most improved, makes sense. Coach of the year, Popovich. And uh, Paris Goodrich, executive of the year. Curry, Westbrook. What did Westbrook average with KD gone? Westbrookish numbers. It's funny that the same exact thing still happened anyways, even though he didn't go to join the Warriors. He went and joined the Cavaliers. He probably didn't get the memo that LeBron was leaving. Vucevic is all NBA first team. I love it. D Book already all NBA second team. I don't think he's ever made an all NBA team in his entire career because his team's never been good before. So that's kind of how it works. Boston Celtics, Andre Drummond, 20 and 15 a game for the all NBA second team. Oh, wow. Giannis actually, so he was an 81 overall. He went up to a 90 already. Emba Walker, Paul George, Ben Simmons, Clint Capella, all NBA third team. He still got Aldridge on this team too. Obviously, the oh yeah, Duncan did retire though. That probably freed up the money for a Harden. I don't even know how the money works in this, honestly. Dante Cunningham, that's a throwback. He used to be on the Pelicans, right? A bunch of teams probably. He was old. 64 and 18 for the Spurs. They're top of the West. And show me an East team, please. Okay, 58 and 24 from LeBron's team, but 57 and 25 from KD and Kyrie's team. It was LeBron and Lowry versus KD and Kyrie. That's kind of nut. Almost happened in this year, too, because Lowry almost got traded to the Lakers. Curry led the league in scoring. LeBron, D Book, Dame, and Zach. Rebounds, Capella, Drummond, Jordan, Vucevic, and Davis. Assist, Wall, Lillard, LeBron, Rubio, and Curry. Shouts to Ricky Rubio. Marcin Gortat led in field goal percentage, and JR Smith in three ball percentage. Wow. Tywood Devin. All right, now that we're in our universe, uh, what teams are good and bad? Uh, uh, Timothy Luau Cabros Bucks, but wait, they have Giannis and they were the worst team. Oh my, no, they were not the worst team. The Mavericks with Philip Burke starting in place of Dirk. That's ironic. Uh, or no, they just have names that sound the same. Revan Rodman, Abdel Nader. Yep, that team is awful. What a Dimity average to lead this team. He was actually pretty good, but everybody else was awful. AD left, so this team's awful. Uh, Mike Conley left, so this team's awful. Although they have rookie of the year Ben Simmons and Mark Gasol. Emmanuel Moutier is here now on this team. Oh, wait, he's been here, right? He got drafted the nugget and yeah Jokic is starting they were still bad kings were still bad i'm just not surprised at that phoenix still bad that's never surprising or although, although they're actually really good in real life no so shout out to them shout out to phoenix fans and uh yeah utah bad the walk you already went over heat are starting to fall off because d wade's probably getting older um nets were really not good philadelphia not the greatest still still in the process didn't get ben simmons either monta sabonis and kemba walker can't lead the hornets to nothing lance stevenson still an 80 but his pistons are nothing too crazy bias harrison all the depot and Vucevic, their magic aren't that great. But look at my Knicks. Oh, man, just made the playoffs. Jamal Murray, shout out to you. Mello's shooting a little bit more this year. All right, let's submit the playoffs now. Let's just do it. Round numero uno by Boston. Adios to the Clippers. Toodles to the Timberwolves. Adios to New York. Sorry, Knicks. I uh, don't mean to be rude to you. Uh, uh, hasta la vista, Ch Chicago. Farewell to Portland. And good day to Oklahoma City or whatever. And I don't have any more. Wait, Cleveland. We got eliminated to Atlanta. In game seven. Oh, my. And it was by three points. Jeff Teague, Schroeder, Bembry, Dwight. Do I end up in Atlanta in this? simulation too wow Millsap. they all just they just beat kevin durant and kyrie irving that is nuts any other upsets i think that was it uh yeah that was actually it i mean you could look and see like the lakers beat the clippers oh man kobe might have another chance at the ring and look at randall 25 and 12 Kobe 18 he might get his sixth ring come on i'm rooting for the lakers because the Knicks got eliminated but uh regardless and the warriors just are about to beat him anyways but the hawks get eliminated 4-0 by the wizards wizards going crazy yet again spurs out of here pacers out of here and lakers out of here sorry Kobe. wow rockets went four rockets how are they still doing this? Montrez, 31. He's averaging 31 a game in the playoffs. This is a man who can't even shoot a mid-range, and he's out here giving you buckets. He's 6'7", can't shoot it. What is this, Zion? Imagine getting the Zion buckets on you by Montrez Harrell, and he doesn't even jump that often. Like that, though, 30 a game? You can't stop the man at all? He is kind of nice, though. So now you got Wizards versus Ra Oh, my God. It's DeMar. DeMar is on the Wizards with Hassan, Bradley Beal, and Wall versus Lowry and LeBron. This man is coming for revenge. And how about the other side um okay so now you got ty lawson montrez and click 
Capella versus Draymond Clay Curry and Michael Kidd Gilchrist, the perfect uh, splash bro, splash trio. And the Warriors just were up 2 0 and lost the series. And the Raptors win the, in OT by two points over the Wizards. Oh my God. Yep. DeMar is having nothing easy out here. So we have a LeBron versus Rockets rematch, yet there is no Harden. And they have Manu too. I just, I, I guess they weren't starting him before. I don't know. Got some red and black team, you know, the color scheme. Two of them to be exact. Uh, let's see. Okay. The Rockets won game one. LeBron had 46, but no, all you needed is Ty Lawson's 27. Game number numero dos. And the Raptors are going to go. Yeah, they went kind of crazy. LeBron triple double with 46, 10, and 13. He might just be getting his ring finally. Would this be his third? I think this be his third. Rockets win this one 104, 88. They're crazy somehow. Um, Next one. Okay, cool. Raptors, you guys are going to tie it 2 2 and make this series really oddly competitive, even though I don't even know how the hell the Rockets are doing it. Raptors aren't even that crazy either. They just have LeBron, Manu, and Kyle Lowry. The Rockets are going to take another game. 38 for Montrez. Giving, who is he giving buckets on the other team? Giving Jordan Hill buckets? Yeah, sure, whatever. Wait, look who else is on the team. Kendrick Perkins. Oh, man. Bro, the Houston Rockets are about to repeat. I have no words. The Houston Rockets are repeating as NBA champions after losing James Harden and acquiring nobody. I don't even, I'm not even guarding Ty Loss. Whatever. Who cares, dog? Yo, let me get a bucket for the more supported LeBron here. Give it to Bron. I'll go on the other end. Dunk on Ty Loss. And there you go. That's all you need to do the entire series. Patrick Beverly, Georges Niang, Clint Capella, and Montres Harold. That is the lineup out here in this kind of close basketball game. And they won the championship. They did it. This really isn't a good look for Harden's resume. Like, imagine you just leave the team and they add nobody and they they still just win again. They even lost Michael Beasley. I love this. That's Joe Johnson holding the final. Oh, yeah, they added Joe Johnson. That was about it. Ty Lawson is the finals MVP. Was Georges Niang even in the league? Is that even how you pronounce his name? Montrez popping the champagne because, well, my God, he bodied it. And how was he not? Uh, it doesn't really matter. Montrez, 24. Joe Johnson. This is who they added. What did he do? A 15 a game. That's solid. But yeah, you left James Harden out of here. And he only had 41%. Niang. Oh, my God. He gave you 15. Braun, he gave you 15 points. 40, 10, 7, and 6. And 6 turnovers from Braun. Regardless, though, look at the confetti. Beautiful. Um, Yep. Rockets. Back-to-back -back champions. Wow. This is an incredible error. I'm going to assume LeBron led the playoffs in scoring. Yep. 38 a game with 10 rebounds. He averaged a triple-double in the playoffs. And they lost. Up, oh, Kobe Bryant retired after 22 years pro. Maybe 21. I don't know if this is accurate. Whatever. Dirk retired. Richard Jefferson retired. Gerald Wallace. Tyson Chandler. Manu. Manu got another ring and he called it. Wait, no, he didn't get another ring. They lost. Dirk and Kobe make the Hall of Fame. Draft lottery this year. What the hell will it be? Mavericks, Pelicans, Celtics, Cavaliers. I don't know what's going on. Whatever protections were on those top 10 picks all went back to the original teams, it looks like. Suns, Mavericks, Pelicans. Um, Well, this is the 2017 draft, the year of like Tatum and Lonzo and stuff. Yeah. De'Aaron to the Suns, John Collins, Markel, Tatum, Donovan to the Nets. Heat still got Bam. Frank Nielakina to the Pistons, the greatest prospect in the entire draft. Obviously, and Lonzo to the Grizzlies. Grizzlies got Tatum and Lonzo. That's actually, those are the two guys I just mentioned, right? And they got both of them. Oh boy, what the hell's gonna happen in this free agency? Steph Curry to the Knicks. Oh my God. Chris Paul to the Warriors to fill Steph Curry's place. Clippers get Blake. And oh my God, the most perfect person to ever join the Rockets. Think about it. If you already have a team that just somehow made, won the finals without any regard for human life, what? I don't know. And like, you want to just fit in because Giannis is just a seamless player to add to any team because he could average six players or he could average 26 and he's just still going to be Giannis and give you his defense and everything. Dog. And they got Drew Holler. Oh, wait, no, that's the Raptors. I don't even know anymore. Ayo, player progression, move along. Okay, but Drew to the Raptors is pretty cool, though. Pistons are led by Marcus Morris Sr. If someone will go over there, but hey, look, my Knicks, though. Hey, yo, we got a Curry. I mean, he kind of wanted to get drafted there. He made it very vocal. He, like, said it on ESPN. Hey, I want to get drafted to the Knicks. And then he didn't get drafted to the Knicks. So shout out to the Warriors. Hawks' best player is Tim Hardaway Jr. Instead of signing him in 2017, the Knicks signed Steph Curry. That's a pretty solid, uh, you know what I mean? Come up. But now they have Simmons, Tatum, and Lonzo. Well, that's pretty cool. And yeah, Chris Paul left the Clippers. So now Blake's going to have to play point guard. But uh, hey, you got, whoa, Derek Rose went to the Warriors too. And Draymond, Towns, Levine, Wiggins are still Towns, Levine, and Wiggins. Towns is definitely 92 by this point anyways, or around that. Rockets, Giannis is Giannis, and then the MVP, I mean, not the MVP, the championship team. Yes, the MVP team. I guess technically that's exactly what you are if you win the championship. And uh, Pelicans have just Markel Fultz, and that's really it. He's the best player on the team, and he's a rookie. Season number three, this is 2017-18. Ty Lawson, all-star starter. Do I need to say any more? That's the god right there, Ty Lawson. Can I see those rocket stats yet again? Hold on. Ah, bring me over here. Giannis, Ty Lawson, Mon Trez, Terrence Ross, Clint Capella, giving him the buckets. Although I just saw like three of those guys are expiring this offseason, so we'll see if any of them leaving at their payday now. I did not start this video expecting Clint Capella to be the star of it. It doesn't even make rational sense. It's not like, yeah, sure, maybe Montrez should have been like a 74 as a rookie, but either way, um, how the hell is 83 overall Montrez leading teams to championship? Hello, hello, Mr. James. Is this your third straight MVP? 
Well, that sounds like a pretty LeBron-ish thing. We, most people say that LeBron should have won the MVPs anyways, like every single year for the past like 15 of them. But uh, yeah, Anthony Davis, DPOI. D'Angelo Russell, all NBA first team. So he was just better than Anthony Davis, huh? I mean, hey, I don't think either of them are complaining as long as the team is good, right? Teamwork. And uh, Ty lost in all NBA third team. No surprise there. Pistons were trash, but that hasn't really ever changed. Atlanta is Atlanta. They have Caleb Swanigan leaving the, leaving the team. What do you expect? Oh, Frank Nilekina, this team should probably be at least the sixth seed. Wait, for real though, Embiid, you can lead your team better. Uh, actually, your team's pretty bad. Uh, Jabari Parker is now the leader of the Bucks, or him and Chris Middleton, so they're not that great. Although they don't think they were that great anyways. Pistons are the Pistons. Brooklyn is Brooklyn with Rondé Hollis, Jefferson, Jimmy Butler, and Damian Lillard. What the hell? How did you get to Chicago? I don't even know. At least I just didn't really, you probably just didn't make any noise. Alonzo G, I didn't know for a fact this man was a power forward slash small forward. I remember this man on the Cavs back in the old 2K days, but whatever, he played shooting guard too. Maybe he was short. He was just, he, I remember he was a stocky dog. Dallas is cool. Memphis is cool. Chris, uh, Chris Dunn's trailblazers are okay. Did McCollum leave this team too? How did I? Okay. Bogdan's Kings are trash. Kadeem Allen's Clippers are trash. That's an awful uh, Chris Paul replacement. And the Westbrook Thunder are trash. Sorry to Juan Blair. Sorry. But all these other teams made the playoffs. Actually, they weren't even trash that, that uh, a lot of these teams. They just weren't as good, you know? I guess no NBA team is truly trash, right? The uh, Dame hasn't really definitely made no noise because they missed the playoffs anyways. And uh, season stats. Okay, league leaders. Dame, LeBron, Harden, Booker, Russell. Rebounds. Drummond, Capella, Jordan, Valanciunas, Vucevic, and says curry wall lost and rubio russell here the hell goes nothing simulate the first round adios to orlando is that already a, a what's it called a, i already see a couple upsets forming let's see utah goodbye los angeles lakers goodbye pacers goodbye new york knicks goodbye charlotte hornets adios phoenix yep okay so the knicks got upset uh sadly you know the celtics led by uh, brandon ingram and andre drummond and isaiah thomas who never really became a 90 overall in this one that's okay you're still doing just fine for yourself i think but uh yeah curry for some some reason shot 5 for 15 don't do that ever again and actually that's it for upsets that's all the upsets there is you could observe the rest of this stuff but okay second round look at houston already storming through this they have not lost a game goodbye to golden state boston lost to cleveland so cleveland look at them oh man it might be cleveland versus the raptors it is and minnesota lost look at you guys trying to storm back into the conference finals but hold on it's the one verse two seed in both conferences it is Kyrie and kd in love there's drew lowry and lebron and semi ogilvy on the other side it's also harden who left this team versus well uh well, you know, Harden, Tony Parker, Kawhi, and Lamarcus versus Giannis, Ty Lawson, Clint Capella, and where is, is Montrez a six man? You might as well just start that man at shooting guard at this point. I don't think he could ever do anything wrong. This man is averaging 20, whatever. I mean, he is a six man in real life too. Or actually, he might start for the Lakers. He's, I don't remember. But he, you know, he won six man a year like last year. Terrence Ross, 14 a game. Okay, here the hell we go. Um, And the Spurs are up 3-1. Rockets, is it finally over for your reign of terror? Oh man. 3-3 three three in the other side. Let's see if there's any sort of intense gameplay here. Which team will be making it to the final? It is 96 96 with one minute left. Norman Powell is at the line. Hi, Norman. How you doing, Norman? Where's LeBron? Uh, Bron oh, okay. Bron just subbed in. Cool, cool. They subbed out Drew for some reason, but either way, I mean, they probably gonna sub back in from Norman, but okay. Kevin Love board. Kyrie's got it on the break. Where's Kevin? Kevin's not even in the game. They got Iman Shumpert in the game, but no Kevin. Kyrie trying to get to the basket. He fades away over Lowry. Awful shot. Okay, I paused it real quick to see where the hell Kevin is, and Kevin fouled out too. Why is it always these players somehow find a way to foul out in 22 minutes? LeBron on the break with a full head steam oh god he's got to buy Kyrie, and he's going to absolutely annihilate Kyrie's soul okay yep that's kind of tough that's going to go down the history books uh, you know that highlight itself but the they got tyler dorse is top what is that who that is is that his name i but i feel like tyler dorse he's a football player i don't even know why they just call another timeout Can you guys miss already so i could simulate it out of this game now they just subbed in jack jackson what who i don't even know his first name i know who he is though but i don't remember his first name passing the Kyrie and get it over with okay passing a reddick reddick down to thompson no, you're not about to post up Tristan. No, no. Actually, there's still a lot of time left. Hold on. Let's see if LeBron chokes. Oh, man. Oh, oh, my. Simulate out. I don't even want to see the shot go in. You're good. You got it, Bron. You won. You won. You're going to the championship. For a second, I thought Bron was on the Cavs and he lost this game somehow. But nope, he's on the Raptors and they won. They definitely won. LeBron, LeBron. Cleveland Cavaliers been eliminated. Deuces to KD and Kyrie. And uh, LeBron's in the finals for the third straight year. This time against Harden once again and Kawhi. But he's also lost the two, two finals. So, I mean, I mean, but let's see. Harden and uh Kawhi. Did I say Kyrie into the Kawhi? I don't know. 120, 103, LeBron 41, but he lost. Next game up, uh, yeah, LeBron won. LeBron won. 27 points from Harden, 31 from Bron. Next game, and the Raptors win it. The Raptors definitely won. 135, 100, 36, 12, and 11 from LeBron, 24, 5, and 7 from the yep, other guy. I didn't even honestly see who it was. I was just reading off the stat line. Well, the Raptors better win another game. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Nope, they choked. They just didn't score for like the last minute, and yep, Harden 27, Tony Parker 20. 
42, LeBron 42. He, well, how does he do so well? All right, maybe because he's LeBron James. Like, can I see real quick? First of all, Harden, you're not playing too shabby either. Oh my God, D'Angelo averaged 40 in like their one round. But yeah, LeBron's still averaging 35, nine and nine. Two to two in the finals. No three ones to be blown this time around, but uh, maybe, you know I mean? A four two to come. And the Spurs just won another game by, wow, it was two points. I actually just kind of simulated through because I didn't think it was that close. But I think they had the control of the lead for the entire time. LeBron 45, nine, nine, Lowry 19 and 12. It's just like looking at LeBron's stat line every game. Like forget everybody else. Then again, it must contribute. If LeBron has the same exact stat line every game, then it must be the supporting cast that's selling him to be fair. It's just kind of, you know, logic. Like if you have no variable with LeBron's game, then well, uh, we'll see though. Let's see this game. Is LeBron about to force a game seven? Uh, yeah. whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay. I think the Spurs have the, yeah, the Spurs have the ball right now. Is that Todd Gibson passing? A shout out to Todd Gibson. Okay. Kawhi, Patty Mills into Kawhi. Kawhi guarded by Braun. Still in the Spurs. Over to Harden. Harden now. Don't take no step backs, but you can cook DeLon right. Go to the basket. San Antonio might be celebrating a championship right here and sending LeBron to his third straight loss. Why does Kawhi have a hand on his hip like we're not in the final seconds of the finals? Maybe his hip hurts. I don't know. Six seconds. Five seconds. Harden going left all the way. Layup. James is off. Rebound DeLon right. They foul, but it's not even in time. Okay. The Raptors forced the game seven. That looks pretty incredible. Good defense. DeLon, what'd you have in this game? You probably had zero points. Six. Game number seven. Spurs versus Raptors. Here we go again. Obviously, it's the finals and it's the same. Oh my, I'm not jumping in, dog. Actually, regardless, but like, dog, LeBron, you lost another finals in the game seven. Yeah, well, actually, well, what is this? Your second game seven? Yeah. Oh, and he actually didn't, well, he still played very well, but uh, he didn't have like 50 or something. If you would have had 50, you might have won. Why 29, eight and six. Tony, 21, hard and 19. Dog, shout out to Toronto or not Toronto. Shout out to Toronto being god awful and shout out to the Spurs for winning a championship. Kawhi Leonard 29, 8, and 6. Instead of winning till 2019, he won won in uh this is 2018, right? Harden 26, 7, and 4 a game when finals MVP. He averaged 31 and 8 in the playoffs. And uh Kawhi averaged 25, 8, and 5. I guess they both did that actually, or whatever. Burton's 13, Tony 12. Yep, the Spurs. So so LeBron is current. This is currently just watching LeBron suffer. Joe Johnson retired. Mari retired. Luca to the Celtics. Yo, the first pick. I don't know who the hell this is. Who is Kieran Wood? I might have to remove you to the, from the league and just give the Pelicans an L for picking you because dog, I don't know who the hell that is. But in this draft though, uh, yeah, Luka to the Celtics, that's actually kind of scary because I think they were actually already pretty good. Didn't they just beat the Knicks? They traded for this pick. Yep, from Memphis. And uh, Trey Young to the Cavs. I've seen some on Twitter saying, who, who would you rather, Trey Young or Lonzo? Uh, who would you rather, Trey Young or Lonzo? I feel like people are jumping the gun a little bit. I actually really like Lonzo, but I feel like people are jumping the gun a little bit on hating the Trey, Trey train. Yeah, um, I had been leading the franchise for a while and he's well i mean i can't say he's done very good because they're still trash but i mean they're, the franchise is kind of trash though in general anyway uh i don't think anything really cool happened in free agency can i see where boogie signed it was oh look julius reno left for the nets all george went to the 76ers that's pretty cool harry giles is the best part on the hawks you guys are awful and boogie went to the rockets oh my god wait but did they lose capella no and i guess they finally missed the finals but uh uh well at least they re-signed montrez and i guess aaron gordon wait they wait where is um, where is Ty Lawson? Most important player in this entire simulation. Went to the Jazz. Ty, Derek Favors, Gordon Hay. I mean, they're all just basically the same team with Malcolm Brogdon here. They're like almost the exact same. This is kind of weird. I guess it's only the elite players like to leave their team. Season number, whatever the hell. It's 2018-19. Yusuf Nurk is one-time all-star. Ty Lawson, still a legend. Kyrie Irving, MVP. Marvin Bagley, rookie. The what the hell? Oh, wait, right. Atlanta is awful. I forgot. Derek Rose, sixth man of the year on the Warriors behind CP. I would assume Zach Levine, most improved with 35 a game. Alex Doyle high. Ben Simmons is all NBA first team. That's pretty cool. Lillard, D'Angelo, Kawhi, KD, and Vuce. And then, uh, yep, yep, yep. Ty Lawson is Ty Lawson. And Marvin Bagley, all NBA team too. Okay, you're kind of stretching it there. Let's check out the league leaders real quick. Levine, Lillard, Curry, LeBron, and Towns. Rebounds is going to be Drummond, Jordan, Towns, Nurkic, and Valanciunas. And the assist is Curry, Kyrie, Wall, Lillard, and Russell. Field goal percentage is Montrez, who's still on the Rockets, obviously, as you could see. And uh, the, the three point, Ronnie price i'm just get to simulating uh, screw it let's just simulate ayo uh yep go ahead raptors wait what chicago just beat the hell out of the raptors wizards you too you guys are pretty good too you had damar in them and you were good and you so there's already just two upsets like actually the raptors were the lower seed hold on the spurs what is going on oh my god thunder okay yep thunder mm -hmm, mm -hmm. warriors ari westbrook goodbye chris paul um new york you you also oh uh, no you were the lower seed philadelphia and oh um, it just got it, absolutely weird the lakers got eliminated the one seed oh my god and they have Jokic. where is anthony davis where did ad go did i not what did they trade him oh wait no he's he's right here he's right here and speaking of him he kind of choked he only averaged 15 Ah, eh, whatever so this was an upset this was an upset this was an upset 
somehow the Raptors were the sixth seed and LeBron just got out of here early this time around. They even have Jeremy Lin. Is Jeremy Lin not in the game? I'm so used to him being in 2K. Wow, is he not in the game this year? And Lillard and Butler got, yeah, they got LeBron the hell up out of here. Who the hell is on the Pacers? Monte Ellis and Pat Connaughton got, really? Boston, I already said they were crazy. And now they have Luka. Lin was able to win in seven games, just barely. The OKC was actually the highest seed too, but they lost, of course, the Rockets. Westbrook and Michael Beasley couldn't hold it down fully. Westbrook had like his MVP-esque season. All right, run up the next round real quick. Portland, goodbye. I don't even know who the hell was on Portland, how they beat the Lakers. Rockets, you're out of here. Chicago is out of here. And the Celtics are out of here. Can I see who the hell was on Portland? Oh, right. right. Zach Levine, 66 points in game seven. What? Um, Zach Levine. Oh my God. Zach Levine set the record or, okay, let me rephrase that because LeBron already broke the record with 73, 10 more than Jordan's 60, 63, um, two years ago. But Zach Levine broke Jordan's previous record twice in the, in 10 days, 10 days. Shout out Chance the Rapper. And that's actually higher than his actual career high, which was also set the season in Lillard at 66. Oh my God. What is going on? I don't even know who the hell is on any of these teams at this point. Um, Monte Ellis, Pascal Siakam, and Steven Adams are up against Kyrie and Katie. They're somehow going to win. Steven Adams is the, like, look, they're even showcasing Steven Adams on the left side. Like he's the best player on the team and they're winning and they're this far into the playoffs. Okay. And then Jads. Oh my God. It's, it's Ty Lawson. Lonzo Tatum, Ben and Marcus versus Ty Lawson, Gordon Hayward, Favors, Gobert and Brogdon. Yep. Let's simulate the round. Oh my God. Cavs went 4-0 in the Pacers. Okay. Thankfully the Pacers didn't win because that was kind of weird. And Utah won. Goodbye, Memphis. You can't beat Ty Lawson. Ty Lawson versus Kyrie in the finals again. And then Gordon Hayward versus KD, Kevin Love versus Derek Favors and Rudy Gobert versus Tristan Thompson. And they got RJ Hunter too. I remember when he was on the Celtics. Okay. First game. And oh boy. Oh, hold on. Let's see. Can they score? What just happened? Brogdon turned it over. Uh, Cavs, what you got? KD's bringing up the ball. He's running point guard. Let's do it. Oh, yo, Kevin, we haven't even seen you play in a basketball game. You keep fouling out. Labissier into KD. Seconds six left. seconds left. Down by two points. Four seconds. KD going right around Hunter. He's going to have to pull up a fade away. Whatever the hell that was. What was that? Is that game one? Yeah, I think it was. 26 from RJ Hunter. What? What is going on? He averages eight and he had 26 on Kevin Durant's dome. Well, I mean, I don't think he was actually guarding Durant, but at the end he was there. Or vice versa. The Cavs are going to win this one, though. Kyrie, 25 and 10. That's pretty good. Is that Thaddeus Young with second on team is scoring? That's cool. Good for him. Game number three. Uh, we're back in Utah, but this time, yep. KD 30, Kyrie 28, 26 from Kayla. Next one, Utah is going to win. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Yep, Cavs sold. Who just missed that three point shot or whatever shot? Young is what young is that? Well, it might be, uh, it might be Trey. It is Trey Young. Trey Young's on the Cavs. So they managed to draft this man. I don't know. Either way, the Jazz won it. Wait, what just happened? What did RJ Hunter, RJ Hunter 30 points? Why is RJ Hunter bugging out in the finals? KD 43, but no, RJ Hunter's 30 is enough for them to win. Cleveland, can you pull out a 3-2 lead? Yep, they will. 14-point win. Durant, 33. Kyrie, 28. Trey Young is somehow the sixth man of this team. Somehow, once again, I'm going to say somehow one more time. Cavaliers versus Jazz next game. And is it finally going to go to the Eastern Conference? Kyrie, 40. Durant, 29. KD and Kyrie in this scenario are getting their first rings. Harden was able to get... So wait, does Harden have two... Yeah, Harden has two rings now. I say Harden got his first ring earlier when it was on the Spurs. Because yeah, Harden has two. He got one on the Rockets, one on the Spurs. And the Rockets got what another two or something i don't even know gordon pull up for three we don't care ayo that is it the crowd is dumb empty are we in cleveland either way cleveland or utah i would expect the crowd to be dumb empty um regardless actually the ticket price is probably mad cheap i know there's probably more than you know what i mean there's a couple people in utah and cleveland jj reddick holding the championship trophy does he ever ring actually no i think it was that he has never he's he might do it this year because uh the, he's on the mavericks mavericks i don't know i think they're probably gonna make the playoffs right regardless though uh, jj reddick has never missed the playoffs in his entire career i believe unless wait see on the pelicans but the pelicans oh did he miss it last Last year yeah who cares i know prior to that though he had never missed playoffs in his career and uh yeah 23 from brogdon 22 from hayward not enough though 40 from Kyrie. you can get buckets and so can kd and so can k love and so can trey young 2018 this is the 2019 season is concluded 29 a game from Kyrie wins finals mvp although i think he won regular season mvp too nate robinson retired boxing um pal gasol retired zach randolph retired anderson varage retired he has been long retired why did he it take that long and who's won the lottery this year kings hawks kings 70 76ers. Okay, you guys are super for trading your picks. Those are definitely not from the past. I already know 2K doesn't update the picks that far into the league. So yeah, that has to be something that happened during the simulation. That means you guys are stupid. Zion goes number one to the Kings and they also get Brandon Clark. I mean, that's kind of cool. You probably should have just drafted RJ though. It's not even biased. We already know who the top three players in this class are. And uh, yep, Ja Morant, Oshkow, Kevin Porter goes top 10. Rui Hachimura goes to the Knicks, who I guess missed the playoffs, even with Curry on the team. And Nets get Bull Bull. DeAndre Hunter, you're pretty cool, but you just had another knee procedure in real life. You keep getting injured, but you're still really good. You're probably like the fifth best sixth best player i mean fourth best i don't know I mean, you were drafted number four in 
oh my god that's a lot of free agents so uh this is going to be the final year 2021 in real life isn't completed yet so i just want to go until the you know i mean until the current day kind of i just simulated fully through free agency like an idiot what happened oh my god lebron is back they lost Kyrie and kd and lebron is back okay let's just go through the teams again 76ers have frank nilakin as the third best player on the team i love you frank and then paul george and towns Towns instead of Embiid. i don't know where Embiid went bulls still have butler oh my capella went to the bulls wait oh wait they lost him last year didn't they yeah and they have michael beasley too cavaliers have lebron kevin love trey young so it's basically like that team post Kyrie, but with trey young drummond's on the celtics still harden's on the clippers with blake griffin and kemba walker okay Kyrie's on the grizzlies now with lon oh god this seems gonna be scary all nba bagley still alone but he has job right now so i guess he's kind of not alone bam out is the best player on the heat still Dwayne wade is not yet retired and lance stevenson is lance stevenson pj mccollum is leading the hornets Ty loss is still on the jazz zion's on the kings he's already an 86 overall which is kind of crazy but he's zion so zion zion curry carmelo jamal murray i guess they lost christos but who the hell really cares anyways um Jokic and bledsoe lead the lakers this team is really bad vucevic is vucevic he's still loyal to the soil with his orlando magic team matter of fact so are oladipo and tobias and i guess they drafted kuzma clay thompson's on the mavericks with john collins anthony davis would here with d'angelo russell on the nets wait what they just left the lakers for the nets the two guys together they both left at the same exact time and then they have donovan mitchell now here now and wait julius randall also left the lakers for the nets what the hell dennis mid jr is the best player in the nuggets kevin durant's on the paces with lamarcus aldridge after winning his championship with Kyrie, and then they broke up and went weird places markel's on the pelicans he's the best player laurie markinen's on the pistons he's the best player and then uh raptors lowry is alone now with middleton now that's a solid replacement for brian cousins antetokounmpo harold gordon ross they're still intact d book is with joel Embiid. westbrook and mike conley are still a duo somehow and uh yep timberwolves now are not timberwolves trip wait what why left the spurs for the trailblazers and now he's with zach levine who just dropped like 80 points per game Chris paul still on the warriors with derrick rose hey, what do the spurs have oh right so they just lost harden and Kawhi and got booker and Embiid. how is tony parker still not retired and still good i don't know warriors are still pretty solid but no clay thompson now and uh beal and john wall and DeRozan are still intact hey yo this is the final season season number i guess five here the hell goes nothing cavaliers are still really really good probably they have lebron James. can lebron finally win a ring this year come on team damien and team harden and then you got ben simmons on the starters and ty loss is still off the bench damien lillard mvp averaging you know typical damien lillard numbers zion is zion mike conley sixth man of the year behind westbrook Ka Kawhi leonard dpoi on the blazers trey young most improved because he had to fill in Kyrie shoes and johnny bryant coach of the year dame curry durant lebron Jokic, westbrook Kyrie, davis simmons vucevic ty loss and jimmy butler Kawhi leonard wiggins and Embiid. all right Cavs are the best in the conference uh you know just just close closely followed by the bulls jazz grizzlies thunder in the west you know ty lawson i don't really understand honestly how he still does it league leaders durant uh wait wait whoa i had it out of order for the first time ever lillard durant curry irving and harden in points rebounds capella and b drummond Vucevic, and adams and assists curry lawson lillard dinwiddie and wall field goal percentage harold williams wait wait no just harold he's number one and three more percentages of course rj hunter tie with luka Doncic. how is rj so good and i think he played for the mavericks too at one point maybe he didn't i don't know here the hell goes nothing simulate this again goodbye wizards goodbye pacers deuces to the kings we don't really care warriors you're kind of cool you got chris paul harden is out of here with his clippers new york i hate you guys sorry i love you but i hate you too denver is out of here don't even remember what, what is that kenneth farid's team um toronto uh, wait braun left them okay so that means braun's still alive with his cleveland team and then you got philly who has uh towns and somebody paul george damon jimmy still up against uh boston with luca and them westbrook's team actually doing very solid against memphis now though who has a uh, Kyrie and a really really good supporting cast and uh utah that's that's uh that's ty lawson's team come on now there's no there's no beating that okc lost to memphis chicago lost to boston utah lost to portland they finally lost oh my well not finally but i mean oh right levine and Kawhi. yeah i forgot about portland right levine somehow went god mode in this george hill luka Doncic, chris dobson on your drum reverse lebron trey young kevin love oh boy actually one hell of a matchup and then on the other side levine and Kawhi, scoring gods defensive god one of them being and then uh jason tatum ben simmons mark assault wow this is kind of nuts that west lineup is one of the best lineups or matchups you've ever seen memphis is up three one three two hold on i'm just looking at the west right now oh my god they're both in game seven let's him cast both of them cleveland is going to win boston is out of here solid solid win by cleveland because uh yeah luke is still just a young and lebron has went god most entire time he's gonna make another final so he's made all but one i believe and memphis is gonna get the trebles the hell up out of here Ky Kyrie is going back to the finals with uh ben simmons lonzo tatum canard meeks johnson gasol here we are it's Kyrie versus lebron Kyrie just left this cavaliers team he, he probably mentored the hell out of trey young but now he's gonna play against trey young who'd assume you'd be kind of nice to the guy that's your rookie you know what i mean you would give him some tips
tips and pointers. But now, uh, yep, he might have to beat the beat the hell out of him. Which, in fairness, can also be taken as pointers. You know, you know, some uh, rough love. LeBron is LeBron though, so uh, he definitely led the hell out of his team to the first win. Although 20, 11, and 10, but Trey Young led in scoring with 31, so he's still giving Kyrie buckets. Game number two. I'm rooting for Bron here. I'm gonna be honest with you. I mean, I like Kyrie. You know, I mean, I like, but Bron, dog, you keep failing. Okay, Kyrie's gonna take number two. 33 and 16 from him. Simmons had 30. Bielitsa had 20. Wait, what the hell? Bogdan? Bojan? Bojan had 41. Bron was passing the ball to him the entire game, I guess. Next one up. Cavs win again. Trey Young, 31. LeBron, 34, 99. Is that all LeBron ever needed was a Trey Young? I mean, you had Kyrie in year one and you guys blew a 3-1 lead. Let's see, though. Let me finish this out. I think this would be taking a 3-1 lead right here, right now, and he is going to do it. 151, 127. Tatum, 29. Kyrie, 27 and 10. 19 and 10 from Lonzo. 31 and 16 from Bron. It is a 3-1 lead for the Cavaliers. Will they blow another one of these, though? They blew one when Kyrie was on the team, and now Kyrie's on the opposing team. LeBron will finally do it. Is he finally going to do it? Oh, man. I'm so happy for you, Bron. 36 and 11. Let's jump in for him. Uh, I'm just going to control a guy in the corner so I don't have to, you know, mess with anything here. But I don't think I don't think they really got anything in him. Oh, actually, the game's over. They're not even fouling. LeBron against Luke Kennard. For some reason, LeBron just bullied Luke Kennard for no reason. Like, the game is over. I'm about to shoot a shot with Kyrie just to mess with him. Come on. Oh, wait. Ben. Ben. Corner three. Ben Simmons at the buzzer. Ben. It's off. LeBron James, after being in Cleveland, blowing a 3 1 lead, leaving Cleveland for the Raptors, not doing anything in Toronto. I guess Toronto's just kind of cursed until Kawhi. Kawhi just broke the curse, you know. In real life, that is. And then, uh, yeah, he had to come back to Cleveland, win with Cleveland anyways. He had to fulfill his prophecy regardless. So he left Cleveland for Miami, came back to Cleveland, left Cleveland again, came back to Cleveland, and then won a ring. So it took three stints. Tristan Thompson and Ben Simmons, uh, I think they've probably both been with Kardashians, right? So yeah, they can relate. I think I just saw that Kim became a billionaire. I know she's got a lot of money, but is that just from the Kanye divorce? I don't know. Did I say millionaire or billionaire? I think we know which one she already was. Tristan Thompson is very tall. 38 and 11 from LeBron. 23 from Bogdan or Bojan. Uh, and 20, 16 from Trey. 16 from Kevin. 16 from Scalabissier. 12 from Tristan. How they only play Joe Ingles one minute. No wonder they lost. But uh, yep, that's it. Cavaliers, LeBron, 26, 8, and 11. Name, I don't even want to know how you average 47 in the playoffs. Can I see what the hell? Did he break another record? Did he break any of the records? Uh, 65, 65. Wait, did Dame average 47 and make it far? Uh, nope, nope. He, oh yeah, he played 16. How did Dennis Smith Jr. average 32 game in the playoffs too? I was trying to see what LeBron was averaging. 29, 10, and 7 in this series or this uh this playoff run. But yeah, Kendrick Perkins retired. And you know, I'm gonna end it right here. That is officially gonna do it. Thank you for watching. Comment, um, comment KP for MVP if you're still here. Screw it. Why the hell not? Kendrick Perkins. I don't really who is the standout of this video? I guess. Oh, wait. Take that back. I'm taking that back. Sorry, I love memes. I love Kendrick Perkins, you know what I mean? But uh no. I'm gonna need I'm gonna need a TL for MVP. Don't let anybody know, but uh yeah, yeah, we're gonna go with initials. So hopefully they don't they don't uncover it, but whatever. TL for MVP if you're still here. Shout out to Kendrick Perkins, anyways. You can click the buttons under the video. You can like and subscribe to the channel if you care about my channel at all. Obviously, I just told you what the hell to comment too. If I don't know what the hell really helps the algorithm these days on YouTube. I don't know if it's oh, do people watch the video all the way through, or they like the video, or they comment, or they 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 I don't know, they eat pancakes while they watch the videos. Does YouTube watch you through your camera? I don't know. Yep, I'm gonna get the hell up and out of here. Uh